what are the various right. hdmi versions and what should you look out for while investing your money in these hdmi cables hello everyone i am tanmay mehta your home technology consultant and like always i am going to share more and more valuable information so that you can make better well informed and correct decisions when it comes to buying anything and everything in home technology now i know many of you won't pay attention while buying hdmi cables because all we are concerned about is what is the bottom price that we are paying for these cables we have been treating hdmi cables as a utility to connect any two devices but guess what it's not just about price because what you are investing is in cables which are supposed to handle your future technology devices and before i begin or i dig deep into hdmi cables its origin i want all of you to hit the subscribe button so that i can sit here and continue to make more such videos which are going to help each one of you now hdmi cable was invented in the year 2002 and became popular in most of the electronic devices in 2004 Now HDMI the very first version was 1.0 and it was supposed to carry a full HD signal and a Dolby digital which is a 5.1 or a 7.1 audio output. Now these cables were not capable enough to handle 4K resolution and that is where in the year 2009 we saw a new HDMI version which is HDMI 1.4 being launched and this particular version which was of 10.2 Gbps speed which means that it could it had higher bandwidth than the previous predecessors and it could support 4K resolution at 30 hz it could support 3D video formats and it also had an audio written channel for your 5.1 home theaters and sound bars now these HDMI 1.4 version cable were widely popular in the market and their primary use job was to connect let's say your Tata Sky set top box to a flat screen LCD or LED TV it was also used in lot of office applications where in your laptops which came up with HDMI ports had to be connected to your projectors which again had HDMI ports now as i said they were limited to 4k resolution at only 30 frames or 30 hz they had 3d format support and the biggest win in this particular version was of getting the ARC that is the audio written channel which encouraged their sales in the home theater and sound bar segment but again this wasn't enough as well so what happened was in the year 2013 there came up another version of HDMI which was version 2.0 now this version was with 18 gbps speed yes 18 gbps compared to the 10 gbps of 1.4 version it supported an additional aspect ratio of 2.35 is to 1 and not just that it also saw major uphold in the uh, 4k resolution support as well which was 4k at 60 hertz and it also supported rec 2020 color space but again the technology was progressing so fast that the hdmi 2.0 started falling short and within 2 years they they announced the next version which is the 2.0a this a was meant for the additional support to the static dr hdr which is high dynamic range and it also supported the hlg format which is the high log gamma format now both these were again meant for larger color gamut that it could occupy in this 18 gbps speed now there came the next version which is today the latest version in hdmi but before i jump into it let me share some details about how this industry has been playing around with the minds of indian or you know us people by repackaging this cables into not version based but something which claims as a high speed ethernet cable now high speed ethernet cable was something that we were just not aware of that okay what is this version really is it 1.4 is it 1.2 1.3 2.0 what is it really well this high speed ethernet cable means that it is only 2.0 or maximum 2.0a version cable and it is not the latest cable which is the 2.1 cable now this cable which claims to have high speed with hdm high speed hdmi cable with ethernet is been still roaming around the markets but guess what if you are going to use this cables for your 4k devices 8k devices or let's say for your dolby vision dolby atmos devices then they are of no good to you or those devices so stop 
paying money for the cables just because they are cheap but they are not ideal for your devices now as i said from 2015 when the last 12.0a was launched there were new standards which were becoming massively popular in the market the first one was dolby atmos in the audio there was dtsx there was aura 3d these were the object based surround sound experiences and in the video place also they saw uh, hdr10 they we saw dolby vision now these kind of color gamuts and higher resolutions even 8k for that matter started becoming popular and the 2.0 versions were just not enough to accommodate these cables and for that very reason hdmi launched a new version in two, in 2017 which was 2.1 and guess what this cable the bandwidth almost grew by 2 and a half times so from 18 gbps in 2.0 version we jumped to 48 gbps in the next version now what does it have to offer well you have got 8k support at 60 hertz you have got 4k support at 120 hertz it has got all the supports for your dolby atmos dtsx aura 3d all the audio formats it has also got a advanced arc compared to the arc which we saw in the 1.4 version and this is e arc the e stands for enhanced audio return channel and this is the only cable in the market which can do the job of providing a dolby atmos output from a tv to your home theater receiver or a sound bar using the eARC ports in the late 2019 we also saw a lot of devices coming up with 2.1 versions like for instance oled tvs your qled tvs the new av receiver range or even dolby atmos sound bars like uh, sennheiser's ambio sound bar all these bars also started coming up with the version 2.1 and that is where you cannot just buy this high speed ethernet cable which is a 2.0 version for these devices because then you will not enjoy the right benefits or features of those devices via this particular cable and that is where you need a reliable version 2.1 cable now for those of you who don't know where to buy this 2.1 i am going to share a quick link in the description so that you can use that link to buy a good reliable 2.1 version hdmi cable and as i said this particular cable 2.1 is not mentioned as high speed it is mentioned as ultra high speed yes because we saw the jump of 18 gbps to 48 gbps that's the ultra definition of this particular gap and this ultra high speed hdmi cables are nothing but the version 2.1 of hdmi so i hope that this video benefits you in making the right decision of buying the cables which are very very reliable critical and important for your devices and your applications so for those of you who are investing in all this new av receivers or buying 4k projectors you need this hdmi 2.1 version cable also for those of you who are excited for the playstation and the xbox series that is newly being launched version 2.0 is not going to do justice for your uh, new devices you need to change the cables to 2.1 cuz with 2.1 you also get variable refresh rate and a quick frame transport cause you need that for a smoother you know image on the screen or a video on the screen so for all the gaming console buffs as well as virtual reality headset buffs you need version 2.1 hdmi cables and do not do not use these old 2.0 version cables and for those of you who are still in the full hd world for them 2.0 is a cable which they can still get done their jobs with but as i said if you're looking for right investment in the right products always remember to check the versions of the hdmi cables that you buy because it is very very important that you stay technologically updated or at least you have the cables which are future ready as i can say so for those of you who have or who need more guidance feel free to reach out using the link in the description it's a link to my website you can i can help you or my team can help get in touch with you for your requirements there are three ways in which currently i'm offering services looking at the number of inquiries i've got a t20 which is called 20 minutes telephonic conversation wherein i can help you make the right decision if you just need to select between certain products 
then there is a home run which is particularly for those of you who are planning for a new house or are renovating their houses and want me to go through their layouts or want them a personal guidance in terms of proposals or what sort of product selection they need to have that's a home run it's a one hour video call that we are going to con you know conduct and you are going to get the recording of the same and the third best way is that you just drop in your inquiry and my team will also get in touch with you for your small requirements so i hope that this video benefits you and if you have loved the information about hdmi versions don't forget to hit the like button because i tanmay mehta will see you all in my next video again thank you